So pages 200, <laughs> 200 to 201 in your R books. So we are analyzing characters. Okay, so before we get to that, let's quickly go over the learning target. So 200 to 201. I can explain the relationships or interactions between two or more individuals, events, ideas, or concepts in a historical text based on specific information in the text. I can use academic language such as text elements and events to share reflections on the people. Oops. Events and ideas in a historical text, okay? So today's goal, today we're going to think about how the different people, events, and ideas, and concepts from Chasing, Lake, Chasing Lincoln's Killer relate to one another. Uh, just to remind you, one way to better understand a historical text like Chasing Lincoln's Killer is to analyze important text elements. Text elements are the building blocks or essential characteristics of the text. You guys should recognize this. We will analyze these text elements, people, events, and ideas. Okay. Okay. So let me get the bottom up. So on page 200, identify key people, events, and ideas from chasing uh, Lincoln's killer. Organize them at the bottom. Okay, so you have all your text elements here. Okay, and then plug them into the chart. On the next page, just a moment, you will be. There it is. Explain how each pair of text elements are related. You can come on in. I'm just going to finish this video and then I'll put my mask on. Okay, so once you have those in, um, make sure you have complete sentences with capital letters and then you should be good to go.